Hi everyone, today we're going to be talking about how to create and modify events in Google Calendar. So first log in to Google Calendar. Uh, you'll notice that I'm in the weekly view currently right now. You're going to pick the date and then you'll notice here on the left side that it has um, times throughout the day um, in an hourly slot. All you have to do is think, okay, what time is my meeting at or whatever event that I'm going to do? Uh, what day and then you're going to click over it and that will automatically pop out this new screen now all you have to do is put in the title of your event so i'm going to do a field trip uh, you can decide if it's an event an out of office reminder or appointment slot down here you can pick the time so if you um, decide later on that the time that you had on there wasn't correct you can go in and it doesn't in half hour time slots so you can move it down notice that it sticks with the hour slot so it was 11 to 12 now it's 11 30 to 12 30. you can change that by going to the ending piece and then deciding from there so maybe i want this to go for three hours until 2 30 there it's done i can also uh switch which calendar i'm using for this event so if you have multiple calendars you can do that i'm going to stick with the same one now if you're thinking i need more options than this they have the spot for that click the more options and a new screen will appear it's got some of the same pieces we just talked about like the calendar um date with the time but it also has things like if you want it to be an all-day event or if you want it to repeat every so often, you can even make a custom repeat. Uh, you can add in a location for that event. You can notify yourself. So the notifications will pop up either on your phone or on your computer, uh, depending on how you set up your notifications within Google Calendar. You can create new ones or you can set up, um, I have these set up so that every time I create an event, it sets up these two notifications, but you can create a new one right here. Uh, and it could be either a notification or an email. You set up how much time you want before that event to be notified. And then you can decide between minutes, hours, days, and weeks. Underneath that, again, we can decide on whose calendar it's going to be placed under. And then you can also color coordinate it. So if you're trying to organize your events. The nice part, I love this right here, is you can add in more notes. So say you're going to a meeting and you want to remember to talk about something at that meeting, you can type that in here. And as long as you go into your Google Calendar and press on the event, you can see the notes from there. On the right side, there's some other options. You can add a guest. All you have to do is click and then type in the person's email and it will send a, a notification so that they can be registered for that event. And then also if your um, organization has certain rooms that you can check out, you can also do that within this. Once you're done getting all that information in, you can click save. But before that, I wanted to quickly show you this. There's another piece. It's called find a time. If you have a lot of stuff going on and you can't figure out a time to meet with someone, find a time will will search through your calendar and, for that day and find a specific time um, that you have available. So that's kind of a nice feature. Um, so again, once you're done, click save. And you'll notice there it is. Now, if you want to modify that event, there's a couple options that you have. First is if you click on it, you can move it up or down. It sticks with that same amount of time or that range that you had. Um, so you can click it and move it. If you go towards the bottom, you can shrink the event or extend it. Um, the other option is if you want to get back into that screen, all you have to do is click it, click the pencil, and it'll take you back to that screen where you had all that information that you put in. So I hope you enjoyed this video on how to create and modify events in Google Calendar.